What's up, everybody? It's Hayden from SA Boxing Talk here to talk about Marutium Talane versus Charlie Edwards. That's a potential a matchup that's happening next. Of course, Charlie Edwards fought in March and Marutium Talane recently fought in May. Let's make this fight. And uh, of course, I'm bringing this to your attention now. I think a lot of people that avidly follow social media and so forth, uh, particularly in South Africa, would know that Marutium Talane is. Uh, he did a video. He called out Charlie Edwards at the end, but Charlie Edwards has also called that Maritim Talani before. In fact, Charlie Edwards called Maritim Talani an easy fight. Now, Charlie Edwards, 15-1 and one from Surrey, thinks that he can beat the old man Maritim Talani, and that's Maritim Talani's time is up. I'm not too sure about that. <laughs> I'm not sure about that at all. I think that Maritim Talani's got a lot to give. I think Maritim Talani has two or three fights left, and then can potentially call it a day. Um... I think this is a great unification fight for the flyweight division. I think it'll bring relevance back to the, the flyweight division. Of course, since uh, Chocolatito has left, it has been a slight bit dry. So, and that's Roman Gonzalez, Chocolatito. So anyway, um, let's uh, talk about Maritim Talani versus Charlie Edwards. Charlie Edwards, 15-1. and one. He got stopped by John Rommel, uh, Real Carasimiro. And remember that Maurizio Solano has in fact beaten Casemiro before. So, I don't know if Charlie Edwards is going on false confidence here. If he's using uh, Maurizio's name to climb through the ranks. But he's a confident young man, you know. He doesn't have a high knockout record or anything like that. So, uh, where, he's, where he's coming from, where he bases that, I don't quite know. Now, Maurizio Solano has not lost a fight in over 10 years. The only the last guy he lost to was Nonito Donia, and that was a very long time ago in Las Vegas. He should not be taken lightly, but I really hope this fight, from a South African perspective, I really hope this fight gets made purely based on the fact that I think Maritim Talane gets the win here. Quite honestly, and then in an ideal world for me, and I think I've spoken to Maruti as well, in an ideal world for him, he'd like to unify this title, defend the uh, unification and uh, finish on a high. Um, I think a lot of people would like the other belts, but of course, you know, Charlie Edwards holds the WBC title, and we know that only two South Africans have ever won the WBC title, so what a prestigious um, belt that would be for a South African to take. So we're hoping for the best. Uh, Charlie Edwards, Eddie Hearn said he wants to get it made. You know, if Eddie Hearn said he wants to get it made, it's probably going to get made. Uh, obviously, uh, I forgot the... And I hate doing this. I forgot the account that tweeted... Maruti had exploded on Twitter like over 90, maybe like 100, over 100 now, 1,000 views, who knows. Uh, Maruti saying, come Charlie Edwards, let's go. And then like a whole bunch of people in the background are like, let's go boy. Uh, you know, it's type thing. So, and then Charlie Edwards uh, subtweeted that. Uh, I'm not going to go into Twitter things, but yeah. So I subtweeted that and said like, yeah, let's make this fight Eddie Hearn. Eddie Hearn subsequently uh, said, let's, 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 let's make this fight. So let's hope this fight gets made. Anyway. Um, for all you out there, who do you guys think will win? Charlie Edwards or Maruti Salane? Have your say. Aight. This is Hayden Jones for SA Boxing Talk. Please hit that subscribe button. We'll see you soon. Cheers.